Hi everyone and welcome to What's Emily Making? Today I'm going to show you how I made this Christmas garland using items from the Dollar Tree and a little help from my yard. Start by cutting a pool noodle in half lengthwise. I like to use noodles because they're lightweight and the curve will allow it to fit over a railing. Work around the noodle and fit these Christmas ornaments around the shape. I like to use all sorts of different sizes and finishes. Some of them are matte and some are glitter, some are more shiny. It just makes it more interesting. Make sure when you glue these that the top of the ornament is always facing in. I found this gold and cream mesh that I'm going to use to fill in some of the gaps. I start by cutting out a square and then I staple all the ends together so it's in sort of a ball shape. Next, I cut off any loose ends and then I fit it into one of the gaps and glue it into place. I found these red plastic bows. I like them because they can stand a little bit of weather. They're a little bit sturdier than interior ribbon. I pull them apart and then I cut them into individual strips. I place the strips in between two of the ornaments to fill in other gaps, just to make it look like there are ribbon curls going throughout the piece. I put a dot of glue on each end just to hold them in place. I moved the garland down to my mantle and I just started decorating with greens from my yard. I used cypress and holly. I place everything just sort of sporadically around up and to the side just to make it look like it's natural. And there you have it, a custom mantelpiece that you made yourself. It's easy and fun to do. I also think this would be pretty to use as a centerpiece for a dining room table. I use the same technique to decorate my railings outside with a lit garland. The possibilities are endless. If you like what you saw today, hit that plus sign and give me a follow for more What's Emily Making. Bye, y'all.